One of the interesting subplots, Rory, you wrote about it today in The Independent, is this Simon Zebo yeah. interview. So what happened? Zebo did an interview which he didn't think was going to pop up this week? Yeah, yeah. He spoke to someone at Racing last week and... Um, under, well, I don't know what did it, if they left it. It seems like they left it kind of loose. Yeah, he'll put that up at some stage, but he kind of may have presumed that it wasn't going to go out five days before they played against each other. And I mean, there's nothing incendiary in it. Um, He's not saying I'm it, thrilled to get out of Munster or anything. No, it's, fairly, it's you know, it's Munster, you know, Racing are a great team, so are Munster. It just, yeah. it won't have gone down well, I don't think, in the Munster dressing room. Um, uh, but, you know, at the same time, it's Simon Zebo and he has the capacity to laugh things off that other people. Um, who take the game a little bit more seriously, or take you know, not that he doesn't take it seriously, but you know, I think he's able to get away with it a little bit more, get away with these things. Like he plays by his own rules a little bit, but it was uh, certainly another subplot. Like Munster just giving us giving us storyline after storyline this week, and that was that was uh, another one that just popped up yesterday, five days out. Um, you know, an interesting time to confirm your new signing, and uh, I don't think it's going to affect how Zebo plays no. um, at at the end of the day, but. Um, yeah, it was interesting. I don't know, are they trying to unsettle people or anything like that? I think they've probably chosen the wrong guy to go after.